All right, in today's parent test video, we're gonna put two natural saline sprays to the test and see how they face off and compare to one another. Little Remedies versus Zarbies. This way, you know, when you're standing in the aisle at your drugstore or Walmart or probably better yet, Amazon, and you're trying to decide between two of what seems like the same product, you'll be able to know and make a better decision. We're gonna compare prices, ingredients, we're gonna check the spray power and the sensation. Yes, I'm going to try them on myself. Both say that they are good for all ages and adults, so let's see how they feel for me because obviously our kids don't always tell us exactly how they feel, especially if they're young ones. And depending on, hey, we should test this on ourselves before we give it to our infant, right? All right, so first we're gonna check out price. So I'm gonna take us over to Amazon. Obviously, prices are gonna vary depending on what drugstore or Walmart or wherever you go. Uh, but let's check out Amazon because that could be pretty much across the board. So as of the recording of this video, Little Remedies right now for a single three ounce spray, it is $5.27. Now it does come with a three pack at $14. 19 so you save a little bit more with that three pack right there so that's pretty good zarbies for one single pack is 550 so it's just slightly more for zarbies for the same three ounce spray and they don't look like they have a three pack option so you pretty much have that price so right now little remedies has the edge with being slightly cheaper now the one that i have right here is a two ounce bottle that's because that's technically the regular size, but it seems like the three ounce is considered 50% more. Uh, so I would always go with the three ounce, which is the size that I have for Zarbies. Either way, it's the same stuff. Uh, so right now for a three ounce bottle, it seems like the better price goes to Little Remedies. So we can close the laptop. Now we're gonna compare ingredients. Now, both of these are just natural saline mist sprays. So there's no medication in either of them. There's no alcohol, no preservatives, and both claim to be sterile, safe, and gentle. For little remedies, it includes water and sodium chloride. The Zarbies natural mist spray includes water, sodium chloride, and aloe leaf extract. So, the Zarbies does have the extra ingredient of aloe in theirs. They also have a version with vitamin C, but I have not found a Zarbies that is just straight natural saline spray. They all either have aloe or vitamin C. So that could be a good thing or a bad thing for you. I think that gives them a little bit of an edge because they have aloe in there, but ultimately it's really just preference. We'll see how it goes when I test them on myself and do the sensation test. That'll really, I think for me, be able to tell whether there's a difference with the aloe or there is not. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna regret or not putting myself on camera shooting nasal spray into my nose, but uh, you know, I'm doing it for you. And now for the spray test. Now I thought that would be a cool little montage of seeing the sprays in action, but I also wanna be able to measure the spray on a piece of paper to see how far they go, what shape they are. Obviously we could tell by the spray itself, the little Remedies is a bit more of a mist and a wider spray, where Zarbies is a bit more of a narrow, uh, straightforward, more liquidy spray. So let's take a look at what they look like on a piece of paper when they are sprayed on. First, let's go with Little Remedies. Okay, and now let's try Zarbies. Okay, so we have the Little Remedies is definitely a bit wider of a spray and kind of covers a whole area. Where with the Zarbies, it's got that narrow, thicker, heavier feel to it. I wonder if that has to do with the aloe being in there, keeping making it a little thicker and a less of a spray, but it's probably also just the type of spray bottle that it is. Just from the look of it itself there, I don't know, you make the call. What do you think about the way it sprays? Like, what would you think as a parent yourself? 
or someone who's potentially trying these out for yourself, <laughs> what would you uh, consider between these two uh, when it comes to the way the spray is? All right, here it is. It's the time uh, where I need to test it on myself. I don't know why part of me is not looking forward to this. I mean, it's pretty normal. I mean, we, we gotta give it to our kids. I have taken sprays like this before. I've taken medicated ones uh, and much stronger ones than these. So uh, I'm kind of interested to see how these feel. That's comfortable. All right, so I have to say, Little Remedies definitely felt gentler. Is that a word? Definitely felt more gentle. <laughs> you know, it felt more smooth going in uh, and and everything, but it kind of just stayed within the front of my nostril, I would, I, I would say, but it was very, actually very, very nice feeling. It's definitely very like smooth. I, I'll tell you, I didn't mind it. I didn't mind it. I'm, I'm slightly congested breathing in. I do feel like I breathe a little bit better in my little Remedy's nostril than I can in my Zarbi's nostril. The difference though with the Zarbi's is I could feel it get a little further in my nose. I for sure felt Zarbi's get a little further. It felt a little more liquidy, which might not be a bad thing because these things too, you could press down and flush out the nose. So if you're looking to do maybe more of a flush, of a nose as opposed to just like a quick spray where like you're flushing so that it kind of comes out the other side like that's that's how some of these are made for uh then maybe zarbies is the way to go uh because i think you could get it a little further and a little a little stronger plus that aloe might be good because sometimes you're just shooting stuff back there it's just gonna make it rough if you're just looking to do it like as a spray just to help decongest a little bit or just to help open up uh, or moisturize the nose a little bit, then I think Little Remedies is the way to go. And especially, look, always, always, always first ask your medical professional, pediatrician, uh, if these are good for your kids or for yourself first. Don't just take my advice. Always go and do that first. Um, but if you were to use one of these with a newborn, I'd probably more go with the drops, the little drop ones. If you were, I mean, this one says that it's safe for newborns, the, the little remedies. That might be a little better bet if you're gonna go with a an infant. Um, for toddler, I think you're pretty good with the Zarbies if you really wanna clear them out. Oh, yeah, that's good. And hey, if you've got a congested baby, make sure to check out our 10 tips to help your congested baby breathe video. Did I sterilize these? <laughs> 